this is uh, the Audi R18 e-tron Quattro, which won the Le Mans 24 hours just a few weeks ago uh, in June. And uh, in that particular race, it ran perfectly from start to finish. There was no reliability issues whatsoever. Uh, we had one small puncture, uh, which was by debris on the circuit. But apart from that, it was able to run you know, over 3,000 miles without missing a heartbeat. I think now a modern day Le Mans prototype like the LMP1 here, it's obviously a purpose built racing car, but it's to the absolute limit of technology. Uh, in terms of design technology, it's in advance of Formula One without question. Here we've got a V6, V6 3.7 litre uh, single turbo diesel engine. We've also got a hybrid system that recuperates from the front wheel, stores it within a flywheel system which sits beside the driver, spins at 45,000 revs per minute, and then when I accelerate out of the corner, it distributes the power to the front wheels to give it quattro drive acceleration. And so to be able to ha harness all of that energy and to be able to use it in the most efficient way is a very difficult task, but uh, you know the Audi engineers have done a pretty good job on this one. Uh, it's always fun to come to Goodwood, and it's always fun to drive a car that's close to your heart that you've won a big event with and to do it here at Goodwood special you know it's still got all the dirt and marks from Le Mans it's as it finished with a checkered flag dropping and so you're climbing back into the car to do it and you know for people to get up close and personal with it is a special experience is it true that the engine is sometimes too strong <laughs> All I can say is that we're always looking for more power and the engine department are continually trying to do that. Unfortunately, <laughs> we always have this argument, you see, the engine department say it's called motor sport for a reason, that there is a motor in the back of it and it is a sport. And so therefore they say that power is what it is, that power is nothing without control.